danger. The last row of the group we'll see on the inside position, 11.35, Frank Armstrong. And beside him, in 12th and final position, 24, Russell Bonsi. Although it looks like they have swapped. So uh, certainly at the front there, Kevin Stowe and Jake Hawkins. Watch out for Ingrid on the inside of the second row. He's had a great night so far. Girdlestone, three back on the inside. Ben Zillin behind him. So we're set to go. 15 laps again in the Stowe's transport. Kevin Stowe leads them away early days as uh, Jake Hawkins settles into second but. On his inside and threatening hard, Kevy, uh, not Kevy Stowe, Kevy Stowe's uh, in the lead. Uh, the other Stowe car out there, of course, and that's Matt Ingram. Oh, they got a problem out there. Mick Girdlestone. Gets collected up there big time. That's not Nick Girdlestone, and the, it's the 37 involved in that one. Girdlestone somehow escaped. Blair Granger's got problems up there. The five, the right side of the car is absolutely destroyed. It's one of the Van Zeelen cars, 77 in fact. Uh, Steve Van Zeelen. So they all go back in their spots evidently. Should they be able to keep going? There's carnage out there. Bodywork damage severe. Car 37 out there. Stephen Carlish. The right side of it rip right out. Likewise for Blair Granger, who's had that right side of his barreled very hard. Just look at them sorted out. The 35 stationary down there, Frank Armstrong. Bob, I'm just going to try and jump in real quick. I just Peter Thorley's just started to get taken out by such a little situation. Yeah, have, uh, Pete, what some happened? great gear up there, Donny Shots, and of course the uh, the trackside shop too with the Nissan nice Sandy and Racing Raymond with all the diecast collectibles. And plenty of time to uh, check them out. But uh, don't go home before you grab a souvenir of what has been a great night. And uh, <laughs> the best is yet to come, of course. Well, Carnage City out here. So we had 12 laps remaining in this one for the feature race for the late models here tonight. So uh, just waiting for the uh, 37 to get around here now and we should be good to go. The lights are out. Frankie's ready to go. 12 laps for the uh, feature race. We're all the late models here tonight. We don't see them out here at uh, Super Tube Auto Archerville Speedway all that often. The 17 is uh, our leader, Kevy Stowe, as he brings them onto the main straight. Jake Hawkins in second place, followed by Matt Ingrie, then uh, Nick Girdlestone on the inside of uh, Paul Carlish in the 75. A good run on the inside there by Frank Armstrong, gets him up in front of the 75 car. Russell Bonsi looking for a way through on the inside of Paul Carlish, they're side by side out of turn number four. Bonsi gets the better of that one. Carlish is in front of the uh, 77 there, Steve Van Zeele at the rear of the field. The 37 of Stephen Carlish. Starting to bunch up a little back in the third. And second position there, and it's uh, Ingrid, a good run in the 54 car. Moves himself up one, there's uh, the 37 once again in problems out there. That's Stephen Carlish. Jay Hawkins trying to rectify the situation that he just had thrust upon him by Matt Ingrid. Ingrid. Here, yeah, Matty Stowe's 54 out there. It's Matt Ingrid having a great run. Kevy Stowe in second place. Jake Hawkins has had enough of this. He says, I've got to get into the action. And he's through, trying to get through on the inside. Here, back to Nick Girdlestone, the veteran campaigner. He's having a great run out there, the Queen Bean man. In fourth place at the moment. And then Russell Bonsi behind him, looking for a way through. Not quite the pace to do it. Further behind there, Frank Armstrong, the best run he's had tonight so far. But it's a 54. Matt Ingrie still leading the way. Only marginally, a one and a half car links the lead in this one as they come around five to go. They go across the stripe. Further back in the field, Girdlestone still holding Bonsi at bay. And uh, the 37 in uh, all sorts of trouble out there with flailing bodywork, Steve's car. 
Stephen Carley, so it's uh, Matt Ingrid, our leader still. Kevin Stowe trying to come back hard at him. And Liner, oh, a little bit slow out of there, Matt Ingrid, and they banked them up behind him. They were all lucky to get out of that one. Stowe still in second place, followed by the 12. Oh, right, Jake Hawkins. Anyone who's race at this stage, we've got three to go. Gerdlestone next. And then the big brave move by the 24. Russell Bonzi tries the outside run. He's out in the loose third out there, right out. There's not a lot of it, but it's uh, sucked him in on the right two wheels out of turn number two that time. Still our leader. One and a half laps from home is Matt Ingrie in car number 54. 17 of Kevy Starr in second. Easing him through turn number four, and they'll see the white flag this time around the feature race. Jay Hawkins, I don't think you do any better than that. Certainly not Mick Girdlestone. Frank Armstrong's had a very good run. But right now, with half a lap to go, you'd have to put your money on this man in the 54. Matt Ingrie. Check a flag time, and Frankie waves it. Matt Ingrie. In first place, Kev Stowe in second. Jay Gorgans in third. Oh, look at the run here. Oh, Girdlestone just in front of Armstrong. And coming on strongly, Bonsey on the outside. Ladies and gentlemen, girls and boys, put your hands together for everybody out here in the late models, particularly Matt Ingrie taking out the feature in front of a large crowd. I'm sure you can reward him with a great big round of applause out there. Matt Ingrie, Kevy Stowe, Jake Hawkins.